evaluator is the president of the Elf Leadership Council. Please welcome Gene Bay. Mr. Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, all of our elves, Marcus, outstanding speech, inspiration, and I want to let you know it was moving for me. I'm excited because I've seen your development over this course, over your speaking course within Toastmasters. And I know that the purpose of this speech, let me just read the purpose of the project, is to deliver speech with awareness of intentional and unintentional body language, <coughs> as well as to learn, practice, and refine how he or she uses nonverbal communication when delivering the speech. Mm. I thought, first of all, your opening grabbed our attention. It was 1990. Mm. You took us to the right to the scene. And what I liked about that, throughout your speech, you created dialogue mm. between the character, between yourself and voice at the beginning, right? And then also when you went, went to the scene the defining moment scene of the Berwick Bengals when you wanted to join the Berwick Bengals football team, you created dialogue there as well. What I'm going to weave in some points to grow on along with the praise, all right? And the point I would want to share with you is utilizing that pause a little bit mm. when you took us to the scene, that, that scene in which you were demoralized. You, mm. you said, I was demoralized. I would just add a pause there. Mm -hmm. And with your body language show, I was done all mm -hmm. And then build us back up mm -hmm. as you did. Now isn't his, his smile contagious? Mm -hmm. That is an essence. I would suggest you continue to use that smile. But then at the beginning when you're talking with boys, show the contrast, mm -hmm. show the Mm. I know mm. I can relate with the smile. Right? Mm. Show the contrast. It's yeah. about contrast, right? Yeah. I love how you ended with the three C's. You had the C's mixed in between are my other right notes. Go with your gut. Get rid of the negative people and give it all you got. Mm. Try this using three G's. So you can put the first G here, mm. right? Mm. The second G here, and the third G <coughs> over here does a couple of things. Helps you to organize the speech mm. and helps your audience to remember. Okay. Awesome speech, Marcus. I'm looking forward to your next speech. Thank you.